Good morning, everybody. Today is January 17th, 2020. And I would like to talk to you about a company that I like and I would recommend you to invest into it for this year of 2020. The name of the company is Office Depot. It's being traded under the ticker ODP at $2.50 a share. Why I would like I would uh, recommend this stock for you. There's a few reasons. First of all, um, Office Depot is in a shrinking space of retail sales. As we all know, if your company cannot figure out how to sell in the stores like it does, for example, uh, uh, Ross, Dress for Less, or TJ Maxx, or Apple Retail Store, then uh, or Best Buy for that matter, uh, then you would be dead in the water and probably will close your doors like, uh, for example, what happened with uh, Forever 21 just recently. But Office Depot is actually accelerating their sales and uh, they're producing a lot more savings for themselves because uh, obviously they got some underperforming stores and they're closing them uh, by, you know, and that will, that, that's cutting costs almost by a hundred million dollars per year. But an interesting thing is that obviously business does need some uh, services and products especially in a booming economy like we have right now so what office depot is uh, trying to do is they, they're trying to copy best buy <clears throat> approach first of all they're matching prices with uh, different online retailers such as amazon and some uh, you know um, offline retailers such as walmart and target but the other thing is that they're introducing subscription-based services. So if your business needs some, uh, you know, delivery of paper or delivery of some documents, some printing services, uh, Office Depot now is switching to this uh, subscription-based model that basically uh, provides businesses with essential, uh, you know, business needs on a monthly uh, basis so uh, that generates uh, you know quite a bit of revenue for Office Depot and uh, subscription is great for uh, returning customers uh, the other thing that goes for um, Office Depot is that uh, they uh, the locations that uh, remain open at this time they're actually trying to grow them by offering uh, more uh, more selection of products they also um, expanding online and uh, they're offering businesses to order online and pick up in the store and uh, this is a major uh, advantage that um, retail stores actually have uh, compared to uh, Amazon for example and the reason is that when you buy something uh, from Office Depot, even though you order it on the website and uh, it was delivered to you just like any Amazon product, if something is wrong with the product, it's not working, it's not correct model or it's not correct uh, item, you don't have to wait for a correct item or a working item to be sent to you for a day or two like you have to do with Amazon. Instead, you could jump in your car, assuming you live close to the home de uh, office depot uh, store, drive there, and you could return the product immediately pretty much and receive a working replacement if they have it in stores. And as I said, uh, now the remaining office depot stores actually have much more inventory, so, in case of something happens, um, they could replace the product for you right on the spot without you waiting uh, for 
you know, shipment of a correct product like with Amazon and with business, it's very important because sometimes you have urgent meetings or uh, the, uh, an urgent deadline and you have to deliver something, uh, you know, this afternoon, especially if it's a business presentation. So Office Depot went up by uh, 20% in the last uh, six months. So I would highly recommend you to consider it uh, to buy for your 2020 portfolio. And here's one more time the information. The ticker is ODP, being traded at $2.50, which is very cheap, has very high potential. And uh, in a shrinking retail space, it's actually uh, would be considered a winner, at least for surviving. Um, so if you would like to see uh, what to do uh, with the rest of 5,000 actively traded stocks in the stock market, please visit uh, our website 2stx.com that will take you to our iPhone, iPad and Apple TV app that covers 5,000 stocks uh, with daily buy and sell recommendations and uh, you would be able to find some more interesting stocks to buy. If you would like to see more video recommendations for other stocks that we uh, advise people to buy, please visit our YouTube channel by going to the website gotyoutube.com that will bring you directly to our YouTube page, our YouTube channel, and you would be able to see uh, a lot more interesting videos with uh, which stocks to buy this year. And last but not least, uh, you could visit our Facebook page by going to the website facebook3.com it will take you directly to our uh, Facebook page where you could see a lot more posts recommendations and videos and talk to the users of our apps about our service and the reliability of our advice thank you for your time and good luck trading